everyone, so my name's Jade and I'm a third year PhD sociology student. And this video is about TERFs, otherwise known as trans radical exclusionary feminists. So TERFs are a specific sect of radical feminist thinkers and activists in the West that actively try to exclude trans people, especially trans women, from feminist spaces. So ideologically speaking, TERFs think that gender is a social construct that people are taught to express based solely on the biological sex that they were assigned to at birth. So basically, they think that all biological males are socialized to be men and that all biological females are socialized to be women and that this is how gender is created. Because trans people disrupt this logic and identify with gender categories based not on their biology but according to an internal sense of self, TERFs think that they naturalize gender differences and reify patriarchy. Accordingly, TERFs argue that transphobia is actually a central part of a feminist critique of gender. This is why they call themselves gender critical feminists. Yet, if we take a closer look, it's pretty clear that TERFs are anything but critical. So TERFs think that only biological females can be women and that only biological males can be men and that anything beyond this actually naturalizes gender stereotypes. But the very idea that gender is always constituted on the basis of sex suggests a biological rather than a social foundation for gender. If, as TERFs claim, gender is based solely on biology, then that would make gender as they see it biologically determined. So even though this contradicts their larger idea that gender is a social construct, TERFs still use biology to mark the authentic ground of gender uh, especially womanhood, whereby only those who were born women are real women and only those who were born men are real men. Ironically, this is the kind of biologically based thinking that they actually criticize trans people for. TERFs argue that because trans folks see gender as an innate sense of self that they naturalize it. This makes it appear like TERFs are the ones that are challenging gender essentialism and that trans people are the ones that are reinforcing it. The funny thing is, is that trans people by definition support the idea that gender is not biologically determined, as they identify with gender based on factors other than biology. Interestingly, this actually aligns with TERF's claim that gender is a social structure. This suggests for me that trans radical exclusionary feminism isn't so much about critiquing patriarchy than it is about espousing transphobic hate speech. By claiming that gender is a social structure and then also making the contradictory claim that trans people naturalize gender because their gender isn't biologically determined, TERFs both invalidate trans women as real women while villainizing them as supporters of patriarchy. With this in mind, it's pretty clear that TERFs simply manipulate biology in order to colonize feminist theory and praxis to the benefit of cis women. This, I believe, is the defining characteristic of TERF theory. So that's my video on trans radical exclusionary feminism. If you liked my video, please give it a thumbs up, and if you want to see more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. See you later!